Guys, just iconic Justine moments. Do you understand? Because Justine is coming Friday, 5 p.m. Justine is coming, guys. Guys, she is coming. She is back. Hold on, is PS5 in stock now? Ooh! 5 p.m. Friday. I am so excited, guys. Justine is coming back to our screens and I cannot wait. I actually cannot wait. Justine is coming back to our screens, guys. It's the icon, there's something about the name Justine. It's just, the name Justine is really making me go mad. Hi, babe. Justine, Tracy Beaker, and Minnie Beaker. Wow, you look just like your mom. Are you Justine Littlewood? You told her about me. Because the name is so iconic. It is so iconic. And she is returning to our screens 5 p.m., I believe, it's not around that time, on Friday. And I thought, let's just go through her, you know, her times and how iconic she is. But before we get into that, we've got to get into something else. Um, before we get into that, guys, we just have to get into this. damn chair with this damn pillow because my back is just doing a madness um i know some of you guys have probably entered this video thinking i thought you were talking about justine from love island i'm not so i'm talking about justine littlewood an absolute legend in the making what i like about you tracy what nothing and tracy beaker as well but i feel like i wanted to make this video just to remind you guys of their iconic food if you guys don't even know what i'm talking about this is a show that came on you know on a channel back when we were all young kids um literally when we were all young kids i remember watching when i was 13 14 15 even younger than that and it went on from 2002 it went on from 2002 until 2006 it was just an iconic show about kids in a dumping ground and, and you know in care and they had beef I dare you to eat a worm. Drama, troubles, and there was iconic food between Tracy Beaker and Justine Littlewood. And it's just iconic. Like, who even remembers when Justine had a TV and Tracy Beaker was a vex? Justine, what's in your bag? Check this out. A TV? You won't be allowed to keep that in your room. Elaine said I can. That is so unfair! She was irritated. So irritated. They had so much beef, even when it comes to the channel changer. 
you promise not to attack each other again? What do you think we are? Animals? <laughs> and when they had the remotes X, Y, Z, whatever, whatever happened between these two, Justine would always read her for filth. Justine would always read her for filth and had her press at all times, 24-7. But Elaine said I was special. And you believed her. You must be even dumber than... Dumber than you? Now that's a frightening thought. Throughout, three, six, five, three, six, five days of the day, three, six, five days of the damn year, she would always read her for filth because she just had that effortless way of shading somebody. Do you mind? Sorry. Oh, must be so hard when someone's dad has got the new mobile phone and you haven't got one. Did I mention dad put lots of cool time on it as well? See ya. Yeah, well, only because he And I just feel like she is probably one of the most important characters of the show. They've announced that they're coming back, you know, revive, you know, re reviving their food. They're coming back Friday and I just can't wait for it, guys. I actually just cannot wait. I'm so excited. I'm actually so excited. This as usual. Lara Croft. Oh, shut it, Justine. It's just, it's just, it's too much. And then obviously when Tracy Beacon ran away, Cam, you know, and Justine went back together. Justine was never a snitch. She never snitched on Tr Tracy, no matter how much beef they had. Then they met on the road and they had beef on the streets. Isn't that shop a little too stylish for you, Beacon? Well, well, well. Justine Littlewood. Is that makeup you're wearing? Are you on your way to a clown's convention? I hear the dumping ground finally managed to get rid of you. I wish I'd been at the party afterwards. Oh, you were. Haven't you heard of the Justine Littlewood dartboard? They only bring it out on special occasions. It tends to scare the younger kids. That beef was a bit mad as well. These two have been beefing from day dot, from day one. Do you understand? From day, from day one. Justine Littlewood and Tracy Beaker have been beefing. And I just felt like I had to create this video. I don't think a lot of people are interested in this stuff. However, I definitely am. Do you understand? I definitely am. Are you actually mad or are you actually mad? They're coming back and I just can't wait. Enjoying yourself so much, you won't bother coming back. Never get your ears pissed now, will you? I don't need Cam to make it happen. I don't need anyone. I'm Tracy Beaker. If I want to do something, I'll just do it anyway. Yeah, yeah. The trailer was dropped yesterday, I think. Hi, babe. Justine. Tracy Beaker. And Minnie Beaker. Wow. You look just like your mum. Are you Justine Littlewood? You told her about me. <laughs> oh yeah, I deny everything. I know two, three, three, four, I think early last week and then more of it was dropped today. So I'm just here for it. Buckle up guys, because it's gonna be an absolute amazing. They're coming to save us from this damn pandemic and I'm here for it. Let me know your thoughts are guys when it comes to this random video. If any of you guys have enjoyed it or watched it, let me know, comment down below, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Click that button guys for daily and consistent content. Click that button and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.